Hello there, and this is my uh, playthrough, my let's play actually of the Mass Effect 1. Now, obviously, this is not my first time playing, but believe it or not, I have never played any of the Mass Effect games as a renegade. So, that's what I'm gonna do. Veteran difficulty. Everything is on max. Not that it matters because Mass Effect 1 looks like utter dog shit. So let's go. Yeah. Welcome to Alliance Military Database. Classified information requested. Establishing secure connection. Secure connection confirmed. Yeah. Enter new ID. Yes. Custom. Email. Please log in to access your profile. Fuck me, I always suck at this. Uh... Shit, I don't know. <laughs> yes, yes, best name ever. Yep, this is it. <laughs> Warning. Data corruption detected. Your shit is corrupted, niggas. Please reconstruct profile. Yeah. Confirm pre service history. I think I'm gonna be. Everyone. Confirm psychological profile. Soul Confirm military specialization. I want me some anxiety issues. Yeah. Believe it or not, I have never played the Infiltrator class. I've always seemed to think it was lame somehow. Um, so yeah, Infiltrator. Uh, shit. I think I'm gonna take Barrier. Yeah. Confirm yeah. facial identification. Now I don't know if I'm gonna edit this, edit this out or not. Probably not. Uh, change of face. Facial structure. No scars, I'm a lady, damn it. <laughs> yes. And eyes. Uh, There's not much customization, as you can see. Uh, iris color. Them blue eyes. Yep. Actually,
no blush. Blush is for... Well, not me. Mouth shape. How do I want my mouth to be shaped? Oh, the dilemma. Dear God. Fuck no. Why do you do this to me? Look at this. This is disgusting. Mm. I guess so. Uh, I've got it. Okay. Now we can. I think I'm gonna go with the... Oh! Oh no. Yeah. With the ponytail. Sure, why not? And the hair color. Let's um, let's make a really anemic because you know why not? Why not? Oh shit! I told you I fucking suck at this. Ugh. Profile reconstruction complete. Here we go, confirm, no turning back. Identification confirmed. Yes. Uh, let us see. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, yep. Well, what about Shepard? Earthborn, but no record of her family. Doesn't have one. She was raised on the streets, learned to look out for herself. She saw her whole unit die on a cruise. She could have some serious emotional scars. Every soldier has scars. Shepard's a survivor. Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. I'll make the call. Right.
Force Prime relays in range. Initiating transmission sequence. Commander. We are connected. Calculating transit mass and destination. The relay is hot. Requiring approach vector. All stations secure for transit. Thrusters, check. Navigation, check. Internal emissions sync engaged. All systems online. Drift, just under 1500 K. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. I hate that guy. Nihilus gave you a compliment. So you hate him. You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. The Council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. Paranoid much? Sure, let's be, let's be the renegade. That's enough. Your soldiers act like it. Sorry, Commander. Joker, status report. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach Eden Prime. Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. Yeah. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the calm room for a debriefing. You get that, Commander? Right. Great. You pissed the captain off, and now I'm gonna pay for it. <laughs> Don't blame me. The captain's always in a bad mood. Only when he's talking to you, Joker. Yep. Hey, to Uh, no, no, put the gun away. Put the gun away. Uh, intimidate all the way, bitches. Let's do a nice save. I told you, I just saw him. He marked file like he was on a mission. See, the Spectres are always on a mission. And we're getting dragged right along with him. Relax, Presley. You're gonna give yourself an ulcer. Right. Congratulations, Commander. Looks like we had a smooth run. You heading down to see the Captain? Sounds like you don't trust our Turian guest. Sorry, Commander. Just having a chat with Adams down at Engineering. I didn't mean to cause any trouble. But you have to admit, something's odd about this mission. The whole crew feels it. You... what? You think the Alliance Brass is holding out on us? All we're supposed to do is test out the stealth system. Why is Captain Anderson in charge? And then there's Nihilus. Spectres are elite operatives, top covert agents. Why send a Spectre, a Turian Spectre, on a shakedown run? It doesn't add up. Yeah, you know, just do your fucking Info's job. on a need-to-know basis, Presley. Just follow the orders you're given. Understood, Commander. I grew up on Eden Prime, Doc. It's not the kind of place Spectres visit. There's something Nihilus isn't telling us about this. That's crazy. The captain's in charge here. He wouldn't take orders from a Spectre. Not his choice, as Doc. As you know. Spectres don't answer to anyone. Yeah. They can do whatever. Commander Shepard, I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. What about? I'm interested in this world we're going to. Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. Mm, yeah. 
No clue. I've never been there. But you know of it. It's become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it really? How safe is it really? You fucking threatening me, nigga? Are you trying to scare me, Spectre? Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? I think it's about time we told the Commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. That's it. Painfully obvious. I already figured that out. We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. Could have told me, you know. There must be a reason you didn't tell me about this, sir. This comes down from the top, Commander. Information strictly on a need-to-know basis. A research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was Prothean. What else can you tell me? This is Big Shepard. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the Citadel for proper study. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Why didn't we keep the beacon for ourselves? You humans don't have the best reputation. Some species see you as selfish, too unpredictable, too independent, even dangerous. Sharing that beacon will improve relations with the Council. Plus, we need their scientific expertise. They know more about the Protheans than we do. The beacon is not the only reason I'm here, Shepard. Nihilus wants to see you in action, Commander. Uh, of course He's he here does. to evaluate you. Uh, why? What's going on, Captain? The Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. Not many could have survived what you went through on Akuz. You showed a remarkable will to live, a particularly useful talent. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. Really? Why would a Turian want a human in the Spectres? Not all Turians resent humanity. Some of us see the potential of your species. We see what you have to offer to the rest of the galaxy, and to the Spectres. We are an elite group. It's rare to find an individual with the skills we seek. I don't care that you're human, Shepard. I only care that you can do the job. And I can do the job. Just tell me what I have to do. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. You'll be in charge of the ground team. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. Yep. Ready to go. Just give the word, Captain. We should be getting close to Eden. Captain, we got a problem. What's wrong, Joker? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. Get down! I repeat, heavy casualties! We can't! Get evac! They came out of nowhere! We need... Everything cuts out after that. No comm traffic at all. Just goes dead. There's nothing. Reverse and hold at 38.5. Status report. 17 minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Take us in, Joker. Fast and quiet. This mission just got a lot more complicated. A small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo hold.
Tell Elenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. Engaging stealth systems. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. The beacon's your top priority. Approaching drop point one. Nihilus, you coming with us? I move faster on my own. Nihilus will scout out ahead. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. Yeah, can we trust him? I don't like putting my life in the hands of a Turian, sir. Nihilus is on our side. He wants you in the Spectres, and he wants that beacon. Right, fine, whatever. Ready and able, sir. The mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck! We are approaching drop point two. Gonna want uh, to get them. He already has encryption given barrier. Yeah, he's gonna die, so yeah, whatever. Equipment, yep. Other helmet because. Fuck you, helmet. Fuck you. Hard, Commander. Hostiles everywhere. Keep your guard up. Shit. Wait, what? Okay. Oh, damn. Oh, fine, I guess. Uh, overload. Sabotage. And actually, I really have no fucking clue what infiltrators use. So... Yeah, I guess I'll just use the pistol for now. Jesus Christ, calm down. All targets down. Damn. Perimeter clear. Barbecue going wrong. Oh, Jenkins is about to get his asshole ripped off. He gon' die. He gon' die. Yep. Get fucked! Get fucked! Yay, my first level. Uh, yeah, I wanted to bury you just. Jenkins.
ripped right through his shields. You're at a chance. Yep. Leave him. We need to finish the mission. Aye, aye, ma'am. Renegade. Some burned out buildings here, Shepard. A lot of bodies. I'm gonna check it out. I'll try to catch up with you at the dig site. Shit. Yeah. Jesus Christ, Caden. Did you take Magma more damage? Time. Shit. Medical kit. This is good. Yeah, that is uh, that good. Yep, just like blood zippers. <laughs> Let's go, bitches. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one who charged your ma'am? I need a status report, now. Oh man. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. Of course you have. Where's the rest of your squad? We tried to double back to the beacon, but we walked into an ambush. I don't think any of the others... I think I'm the only one left. You abandoned them, yes. Why would I say that? Jesus Christ, I'm starting to miss Paragon traces. Any idea what kind of enemy we're facing? I think they're Geth. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? It's a good question. They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. Yes, stay here. No, take us there. You're coming with us, Williams. We need that beacon. Aye, aye, ma'am. It's time for payback. Yes. Move out. Move out. Yep. Yep. Yes, Williams. Well, let's see what we can see. So trifles, bitch. Yep. The beacon's at the far end of this trench. Yeah, well, we'll see about that, won't we? <laughs> 